Hey guys, Dapper Dad here with another quick tutorial, this time on the best way to get silica pearls on the island for ASA. If you're clicking on this video, you're probably here because you're struggling to get electronics and things of that sort. You need a lot of silica pearls in order to make those, so I'm going to show you how to do that. Let's jump straight into this. Okay, so what are we going to need to get this done? The first thing you're going to want to do is tame a low-level megalodon, or any megalodon for that matter. It's just, the point is, this tame is just for getting us out into the ocean into the deep um, you need something that can kill some things so you don't want to take a dolphin so get you a megalodon throw a saddle on it and then what you're going to need in addition to that is you're going to need some trank arrows a crossbow uh, some scuba fins and a scuba tank makes this easier however i have done this without a scuba tank before you just have to keep going to the top for oxygen it's a little more difficult but it can be done if you're running low on resources all right, so now we're ready to get out into the ocean on our maiden voyage, right? But the first thing you're going to notice is when you get out here, it's really cloudy and murky. You can't see very far. So before you do this, regardless if you're on PC or Xbox or PlayStation, I do recommend inputting a couple settings first. The first one you're going to want to put in is this setting, which will help open up the water. So as you can see here, you can see much, much better. Um, and the next one that I would recommend putting in is going to be for the fog quality. Uh, again, these will work on any console or PC. Okay, so now what you want to do is you want to throw on your scuba fins and your scuba tank. Uh, again, you can do this without a scuba tank. You just have to keep going and getting oxygen, which can make it a little bit more difficult. So I do recommend if you have the resources, just go ahead and grab you a scuba tank as well. All this is prim, of course. Uh, I haven't spawned in anything that's going to be super high end here. Uh, what we're going to do is we're going to swim out to the wall and we're going to be looking for an angler fish. Um, I do recommend going in orbital camera like this so you can look around and or if you're on PC, K mode or K cam. All right. So what we're doing is we're looking for an angler fish and oh, do bring a spyglass that is super helpful, especially if you're trying to find the levels. And as you can see here, there's a level 50. Now, the first thing you're going to want to do is look around and make sure you've cleared everything out. Uh, there's going to be sharks, you know, stingrays, other angler fish, perhaps even, and you want to make sure you've already done that. For the sake of this video, I've already done it, so let's just hop off our tame, equip our crossbow, and we're going to start taming this angler fish. Okay, there we go. We've got it unconscious. Uh, so the good thing about an angler is you don't need a saddle. All you have to do now is stick some meat into it. And just to demonstrate, you really don't need a high-end tame. I'm going to just stick regular raw meat in. If you have some prime meat, great. It's going to come out even better. But I'm going to just demonstrate you really don't need a high-end angler fish to be able to get a ton of pearls. So uh, I'll be right back with you guys in a moment once this thing tames out. Okay, so now that the anglerfish is tamed out, you're just going to want to hop on your fish. Again, you don't need a saddle, and you're going to want to head to the southwest part of the map. So 0, 100 would be the coordinates, and that's exactly where you're going to find a ton of silica pearls. Now, you'll also find these pearls all up and down the west side of the map, uh, as well as the east side and the north. It's just the south that seems to be kind of low on pearl nodes. Uh, but once I get there, I'll fast forward and I'll show you guys exactly what I'm talking about. Okay, so now that we're here, what you want to do is make sure you have stamina, and uh, when you get to the bottom, just don't stop moving, all right? There's going to be mozas, sharks, everything's going to be chasing you, eels. Uh, you do not want to stop moving. If you stop, it's a death sentence, and you will likely get caught into a ball of megalodons and not make it out. So come to the bottom and just start biting. You're going to notice these shiny little pearls like you see right here and they're going to disappear. As you are doing this, you're going to notice your pearl count going up quite high as you can see on the left side. All right, once you've cleared out an area, just simply head north up the maps, the west coast here, and you're going to see more and more pearl nodes all along the edge of the map. Okay, so as you can see, we found some more. You just want to go along the bottom and keep biting. And even if they're on the outside of the border, go ahead and bite. It'll actually give that entire pearl node to you. 
And as you guys can see, we're getting loads and loads of pearls here. So this is way better than going and picking them by hand up in the snow biomes. Again, just keep moving. Don't stop. There's going to be everything chasing you. Uh, if you get hung up, just swim up. Usually that'll clear it. All right. So how much do we end up with? We have... As you can see, this is a much better way to get pearls, guys. Uh, if you're picking them by hand up in the snow biome, you're just doing it wrong. So get you an anglerfish, and when you're not using it, I recommend just build a little 2x2 two two stone pin, as you can see here. And then when you come back, you know you always have an anglerfish ready to go, and you can quickly run pearls. Just park an RG beside your anglerfish hut, and then run it back to your base. That's it for today, ladies and gents. If this helped you, I really appreciate the likes and subscribes. We just hit 100 subscribers. I'm gonna try to go for 1,000 next. So if this is helping you, give it a thumbs up, and I appreciate you being here. Until next time, ladies and gents, Dapper Dad out.